Well, Michael, I see you're back around and making time for your mental health. Yeah, I don't know why I came. Hmm. What do you want, Michael? I don't know. Just... I just want... I want something that isn't this. You know? This caring about two things at once. I mean, I want to be a good dad. Love my family. You know, live the dream. But at the same time... I really want the other stuff, too. I suppose you haven't really considered the fact that by neglecting your therapy, you've guaranteed these behavioral relapses. No, I hadn't considered that. So, pal, what's the source of conflict this time? Things are kind of on the uptick, Doc. There's no greater concern than optimism. You know what, Doc? I'm okay. Things have finally come together for me. I mean, I made a bunch of money, and most of those guys that wanted me gone, <laughs> they don't want nothing no more. <clears throat> well, I'm not going to pretend that my life's not still a mess. I mean, I know I still got a long way to go. You know, with my family, my friends, my aspirations. I mean, I know. I've done a lot of bad things, Doc. I told a lot of lies. But, Doc, I'm hopeful. Oh, I, mm. don't hide behind hope, Michael. Hope is the enemy of hard work. Any other acting out, friend? Tell me. I, I, I've been out of control, Doc. I think I got, you know, an imbalance or something. You know, I mean, one minute I'm one person and the next minute I'm another person. And you sometimes feel you're not responsible for your actions. It's all denial. <sighs> it was a fuck up, Doc. I'm still a good guy underneath. Hmm. Anything else? Anything sexual? I've been a really good boy, Doc. Really good. Not one problem. I'm glad to hear that. Really glad. Keep working it. This is great. I want to be good, Doc, I really do. But then I get angry. Hmm. Anything else? Anything sexual? I've been well. I mean, I've had thoughts, but I've been good. <sighs> Not a single problem. We all have thoughts, Michael. Not acting on them is real progress. So I feel like there's progress in some areas and, you know, none in others. That's incredible stuff. I don't think I've ever heard such a barrage of denial, self-justification, and outright horror. The thing is, Michael, here, can we just get a quick photo together? Cheese. What is this? I really think I can't treat you anymore. The fact is, I'm in love with you. What the fuck are you talking okay, about, Okay, well, Doc? that's not true. <laughs> Good. You're learning. Good. What's going on? Nothing. It's just... I think you need a new therapist. And I'm leaving town. I've got a TV show. I'm gonna be famous. I'm gonna be famous. <laughs> Think of the fucking tale. All those fucking bitches who called me pube head. Oh, <laughs> they'll be lining up to suck it now. You got a TV show. You. Uh, best not to think too closely about what I just said. It's not like I'll be using real names or anything. <laughs> I'm really discreet. <laughs> Bye now. Stop and think about it! Deep breaths.
time you'll listen. Well, you know what I mean. You wanted me to listen to your problems? Now the whole country will listen to your problems. I poured my heart out to you and my wallet. Come back here, asshole. You're acting out, Michael. Don't act out. That's my life. Don't you want to be famous? Everybody wants to be famous. It's a primal urge. I trust in you, you prick! Stop and think about it. Deep breaths. Calm, calm. You fool! Pube head! This kind of exposure will push you to the help you need. You fucking head trigger! Isn't this the attention you were looking for? How you doing? Okay, honey. How are you? Rioters and copycat killers. Conspiracy theorists have blamed various celebrities. <sighs> the mayor, the soldiers, Come on. the skirts, women's liberation, and hidden aliens embedded amongst us for the murder. But not all crime is premeditated. Maybe drinking's your thing. Look at this drunken buffoon proving that there doesn't always... Oh, I'm gonna be a better me. Hey, son. Hey, Pop. Breaking news. Isaiah Friedlander killed. Good taste may have finally died off in this town. Radio host and author Isaiah Friedlander was murdered by an unknown assailant yesterday. The psychiatrist only recently rose to fame following the publication of his hugely successful book about his relationship with an idiotic, if terrifying and amusingly deluded sociopath and apparently retired bank robber he codenames Marky DeSantos. Market analysts are warning that the last residents in town with taste are dying off, leaving many to worry what this means for the local art and real estate market. Architectural gyms are languishing on the market.